Hi, Oviedo. Today we are at the preserve of Oviedo on the Park. We are Kat and Jeremy West, your local Oviedo Realtors, and we are really excited to show you this community because this is where we live. Let's show them around. So this community has 44 homes. They were built by David Weekly back in 2017. Mm -hmm. One of the newer communities in Oviedo. Right now we're on Windy Pine. There's two streets here, Windy Pine and Oviedo Boulevard. Right, so um, average price point now is about 580,000. Um, all two story homes. Um, most of them gonna be between 2,500 square feet and a little over 3,000. Um, but there are a few that are in the low 2000s as well with a downstairs master. Yep, and this street, Windy Pine, they all have backyards. On Oviedo Boulevard, they have, a, some of them have a small backyard space, but not enough to have a pool or anything like that. Yeah, and um, yeah, just some things to point out, I think, you know, it was kind of funny because when we first were looking for homes, we wanted big single story, we wanted a lot of yard space. <laughs> well, you can see, probably the one drawback to this community is the homes are pretty close together but we just used to walk to the park every single day and it's the only community that is literally in Oviedo on the park yeah so we just fell in love with yeah being able to live here <laughs> well and if you don't want a home that is close together obviously you're not going to be able to change that but mm. if you're okay with that then the positive is that the preserve is behind you. So nothing can ever be built behind you. And the yeah. preserve is really cool. I wake up awesome. early and go sit outside and there are so many different types of birds. We have woodpeckers, hawks, Cranes. Uh, cranes. We, oh. we tell our son they're pterodactyls because they're just loud sometimes, but it's awesome. It, it literally, there can be hundreds and hundreds of birds out there every single morning. Right, so we're just turning the corner from Windy Pine over to Oviedo Boulevard and in between the two are our mailboxes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, an interesting fact, you know, when I worked in new construction, everybody would always ask like, why do these communities not do mailboxes anymore? Just so y'all know, that's usually required by the cities. So a lot of builders or new home communities would do mailboxes if they were allowed to, but it's just not within the city requirements with all the people and I guess the post office and how much time they have in a day. I don't know, but they just don't let you do it. So that's why. I just learned something new today too. <laughs> <laughs> all right, we are making our way around the bend to the other entrance of the preserve. This is Oviedo Boulevard side. Yes, and this also goes straight into Oviedo on the park. It's one big circle. These homes on Oviedo Boulevard, they have the garages in the back and they have street parking out in the front. It really gives you kind of like that, more of a city vibe on this side of the street. Mm -hmm. um, very charming, as you'll see the gates and it just feels like, what did you call it? Like Baldwin Park. Like Baldwin Park. Park, yeah. It really, if you've been to Baldwin Park because you know, the front of the houses come right up to the street. There's some parking right on the street, which we'll show you. Um, but really nice. I mean, like she said, they're charming. I would say that the um, average price per square foot on this side is a little bit less than the Windy, P Windy Pine Way side. Yeah, um, and I because in the Windy Pine Way side, you get the backyards that are on the preserve. Yeah, more backyard space. You could have a pool if you wanted. Yep. <laughs>
standing on one side of the preserve between the two streets on the other side back there that's Oviedo on the park if you have not checked out that video make sure to check it out we tell you all about it yeah and before we say goodbye we figured we'd show you just a few shots of our backyard on that side so you can kind of see up close and personal um, the preserve and until next time bye Oviedo All right, so I really hope you all enjoyed the video of the preserve at Oviedo on the park. So you can see where it's located on the map. It's this yellow area right directly north of the park. So you just walk right in there. This big green highlighted area is Kingsbridge West. So make sure you check out that video as well too. But um, we'll go ahead and end. We did some drive-by footage and you'll be able to you know, drive from basically this entrance going all the way around Windy Pine Way to Oviedo Boulevard. And outside of that, have a great day, Oviedo.